the next question page number 229 question number 1 and this question they have asked already in board examination in 2016 the question is consider a circular loop of wire lying in the plane of of the table let the current pass through loop clockwise apply the right hand rule to find out the direction of magnetic field inside and outside the loop okay so how to solve these type of problems as in that instead of paper we have board okay and i have circular coil here now yes i have a circular coil here and the board is considered as paper right now the current is passing through in clockwise manner the given in question paper right the current is passing in clockwise manner right and apply they said apply a right hand thumb rule to find out the direction of magnetic field so here the current is passing in upward direction right this one right yes therefore the magnetic field becomes outward yes yes clearly and what about the inside if i turn like like that what about the inside yes it's inward direction inside it is inward outside it is outwards right this direction is outwards outwards and this direction is inwards see listen here so this is outerwards right and this one is inwards right similarly and that circular coil and that circular coil the outside the magnetic field is outward direction and for inside it's inward in direction so this is outwards right and for in, inside it comes inwards direction this is inwards right so here i wrote consider a circular loop of radius r with the center o lying in the plane of the paper where the current i pass through the loop clockwise direction according to right hand thumb rule the direction of magnetic field is identified so the direction of magnetic field inside the loop perpendicular to the plane of paper inwards inwards right coming inwards perpendicular means for this board the magnetic field will be perpendicular and similarly the direction of magnetic field outside the loop perpendicular to the plane of paper outwards so this question is important they ask in board examination number of times thank you see you in the next video